Hi, my name is Darcy Pickering and I'm the orchestra teacher in the Pearl River School District. Today I'm going to show you how to tune the cello using the Korg AW2 tuner. So the cello has four strings. The highest is A, and then we have D, G, and C. The strings are attached at two points, up here at the tuning pegs, and down here at the fine tuners. To tune the cello, you want to start with the A string. I'm going to bow the A string and watch the tuner to see that the needle lands in the middle. And I should also see two arrows pop up on either side of the note name. My A string is about half a step flat, so I'm going to turn the tuner to make the string higher. As I'm turning the tuning peg, I'm also going to try and push it in so that it'll stay when I'm done. Sometimes the peg won't stay, and in that case you need to turn the cello around and hold on to the neck really tight and really push the tuning peg in. Then use the bow to check the string. Since the string is so close, I'm now going to use the fine tuner just to make a small adjustment. So next I'm going to go down to the D string. The D string is attached to this tuning peg up here. Again, I'm really close, so I'm going to use the fine tuners. The next string is the G string, which is attached to this peg. Again, this peg is not going to stay, so I need to turn the cello around. And finally, the C string, which is attached to this peg. The C string is tuned a little bit high, so I'm going to use the fine tuner to let it out. When you're lowering a string with the fine tuner, you want to go below the pitch and then turn back up to the pitch. As a final check, you want to go back and make sure that all the strings are still in tune.
And that's tuning the cello with the Korg AW2 electronic tuner.